Fast card here, guys, and uh, welcome back to another episode. Today, what we got going on is we got the tarantula here. And uh, if you guys saw my last episode, we put the ramp crab uh, axle wire kit on here, extending uh, 11 millimeters on each side, really widened her up. And uh, the whole reason for doing that is uh, we're going to take these DJ crawler tires, uh, 68 millimeters, and uh, we're going to slap them on here. So stay tuned, guys. Alright guys, so uh, these are the aluminum uh, beadlocks I will be using. I ordered these off of eBay. Um, if you guys have seen my channel very long, you know that I'm a budget builder. So I ordered these. Uh, they came from China. These honestly are like a trail knockoff. Um, you see it's pretty nice. Did come with this little, uh, almost like a super swamper tire. Uh, but it's tiny tire. Tiny. <laughs> so, uh. All I wanted though was was the wheel or the rim, and we ordered the comp pins, and uh, they come with two different uh, foams. It does have the soft foam in there, and that's what I'm going for. Heard a lot of great reviews about these. Excited to get these on. Uh, the biggest thing though was uh, I had ordered this, and when I put it on, when I turned. I was rubbing there before so now you can see with the uh, axle widened how far away I am from that so uh, we'll go ahead and get these other ones tore apart put these other ones on get all four on and uh, we'll test her out so guys uh, these cheap uh, eBay tires hobby sole or rims I mean uh, it is a four piece so, the way this works is you stick this bead in the tire, obviously. You're going to stick this part in there first. This is the outside part, and it's deeper. You'll be lining up this back part. So you got those lined up, got the bead in there. And then you take the final part and uh, line it up. Just like that. And put those screws in. Really nice, simple, uh, nice design, though. Guys, I will tell you, this is one of the easiest speed locks uh, I've ever had to do. Uh, for a BHG eBay uh, rim, man, it's pretty good quality. Uh, highly suggest those. Love it, love it, love it. Plenty of room there. So uh, let's get her out. So guys, these uh, tires, they really do perform really well, especially on uh, the hard rocks there. Um, one thing with the axle winding kit, is uh it seems like i really have to pay attention to what lines i'm picking the back pumpkin um easily sticks down and in the way and you'll see here in just a minute where i get caught and where i struggle uh to get up just because of the pumpkin
right here you can see where I'm going to get the back, back pumpkin uh, caught here or back diff. Um, still got grip. She wants to almost flip over backwards. That's the only thing I've seen uh, with the axle winding kit. Otherwise, it's been great. So I did bring it out um, onto some clay, uh, rock, uh, desert almost like substance here. Did get plenty of grip with these tires. Um, love the axle winding kit. All Like I said, you really do have to watch your lines though. Next, uh, we'll be trying this 70 millimeter in drawers. Um, at the time that I got this axle winding kit, I got it for the 68s and the 70s were not out, but they are coming out and I've got them ordered. So as always, guys, like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you all for watching, and we'll see you on the next episode. Laters.